Hey. Hey, guys. Hey, Melissa. We're so excited to do this podcast today. This is the best day you could come on because Portia generously lent us this awesome Macan. I love this car. Get comfortable. We're going to drive to the studio and then we'll tape our podcast. What drove you to start your company, Baked by Melissa? Well, I love cupcakes and then I got fired from my job. So I went home and baked cupcakes. Well, first I went to my brother's office crying and he said, go home, bake your cupcakes. We'll start a business together. How do you maximize your alone time and prioritize your own needs? Like, what does your day look like? Well, this morning I woke up at five. That's too early. The morning is my time <laughs> of peace. I go pour myself cold brew. I try to do yoga in the morning because that just makes me my best self and it sets me up for success. Can cupcakes be a breakfast food? So that's a tough question. I think by today's standards, anything could be a breakfast food. However, I truly believe that mealtime is for nourishment. And if you get your nourishment through your meals, you can indulge in dessert every single day. How do you think you've changed as a boss in the last few years? I'm evolving, as we all are. I'm learning, I'm growing, I'm becoming a better, smarter, I hope, version of myself every day. Do you have an unnecessary necessary? It's like something that is both productive, like you have to do it or you should do it, but also brings you joy. All of the stuff I do on social media is really done in my own spare time, and it actually brings me so much joy. What are some tips you have for our audience on how to make their days more productive? I'm big into goal setting and understanding what your priorities are. What's like a productivity hack that you do every day for work? My productivity hack is that if it's going to take two minutes and I have two minutes, I'm going to do it. What is your favorite cupcake flavor? So I always say it's peanut butter and jelly because it is. It's so good. And that I could that definitely be eaten for breakfast. I like the tie-dye the most. I like the cookies and cream one. Ooh, that's my three-year-old's favorite flavor. Smart three-year-old. When there's like a stressful moment in your day, how do you move forward? I recognize that I'm feeling stressful. I take a deep breath and I just like compartmentalize it and get it out of the way. For me, it's like breaking the moment of like, okay, maybe I need to go take a walk. Maybe I need to go breathe somewhere. So like kind of just recognizing that about myself. Well, this was a great therapy session, guys. Thank you. I feel so lucky that we get to have these types of conversations, go to the studio and get even more inspired. We made it. Thanks to our lovely Porsche.